Welcome to my channel. I'm D Hicks. Today I'll be talking about the features of a desktop app organizer called Fences 3. Let's get started. Fences 3 is a app that is uh, organizes your desktop app, uh, apps and it uh, hides them from view on your desktop and it also organizes I have uh, about eight on my home screen here I have uh, main apps I have one called SD files and uh, my GPU overclock tools and virus protection and Sony movie studio video editing and downloads and documents and <clears throat> this main one, this one has all the apps that's, uh, some of the apps that's downloaded to my computer. I have it, uh, it's where it's easy to uh, change the titles. You just, could just um, click on that and you can change the title, whatever you want. Uh, I have this one just called Main Apps. You can change the title to whatever you want and as you can see I scrolled off of its hideaway by itself too here this X here is where you can delete this fence if you don't want it no more and here on this here three lines here you have a smaller menu where you can just click on this to say rename the uh, fence and you can change the view of this the opacity of the uh, fence here and you can sort the fence by name size item type and date created all options here and you also can organize the fence which uh, you can send new folders to this fence or new documents new images or new music video to the fence or new downloads or new web links but I have the currently set to uh, uh, install the uh, new program shortcuts here in this fence. Okay, you can simply drag it anywhere you want on the screen. Anywhere you want it. And uh, just to lock it in place, you can just right click on it and go to view and here you can drag go down to lock fences and won't be able to move it and you can also have more options in here where you can change the icon size like increase it to large here as you can see large icons I put them in medium And like I said, the others, this here also, I already went over these is settings here. Okay. It's in the roll-up fence configuration. Okay. If you want to go to the main app, configure fences, just click on that. And it'll bring up the startup Fences 3, where you can go through all these, uh, read through this and then help you learn more about fences and how to uh, customize it to your liking. This is the uh, home page where you can go through different, uh, how you make it work better for you. You can change the color and appearance here. You've got these little switches here. You can change it, all the fences you have on your desktop or you just want to do individual ones you have created. You have it, in your, it show it right here in the list of all the fences created. And you can uh, adjust label text color. I just click on that. And let's see if I want to change the color to red. 
Okay, and I press OK, and it changes the uh, color of the titles on my fences to red. See if I want to change just the color again. See blue. Just press OK, and it changed it to blue. You can adjust the label, also adjust the label font and font size if you show uh, desire here. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. I'll put in italic and Sugoi UI italic 16, size 16. Press OK. And it changed the uh, fonts. Yeah, like I say, you can go through all these different settings. Oh yeah, um, to customize the way you want. But here's one particular one: quick hide. It will hide all of your uh, fences. You just double click, and it disappeared. It's still there, but it's just in, uh, invisible. And you click again. There it is. They reappear. Nice feature. Um, it's uh, easy to use here uh, on this uh, about page here you can manage your product key and you can check for updates here as well okay All right, let me unlock the fence so I can show you how to create a fence on the screen Okay, you simply hold your left click button on your mouse, and let me take it in this blue spot over here, and drag it across. And it's as you can see in this corner. I don't. I got it in this in the lower corner. You can't hardly see it. Let me move it where you can see it at the top here. Okay, let me drag it. Left click and hold. Let go. And as you can see here as a create fence here and you can create a folder portal here as well well I'm gonna create the fence here I'm just gonna name it a a test fence okay it's on auto hide let me move it where I can see this fence there here is now it's set, uh, I was in the settings and I set it where this particular fence where it'll auto hide the title. And you see it's very transparent. You can change the background of this uh, fence by, let's go, view the opacity, 20%. Change it again. You can change the uh, I have all of my uh fences with the same settings. Like say you got you can change the uh opacity of this here fence, change it to where you can see the uh, background of it. Okay, let's open up the main one, okay. Here you can adjust the transparency. Here is where the, you can control the transparency of your fence here. I brought the color. You can see the background is changed here to more darker black, and you can change the color intensity here. Yeah, you can change the color, whatever you want it to be. Okay, I like mine's all the way transparent. 
I'm semi-transparent here. Okay, right here is just where you can uh, change the colors. You just go on op options and go to color and appearance here. Yeah, it's easy to do. Okay, and um, if you choose not, you don't want this fence on the uh, fence, you can just click on this X and remove fence, and the fence is gone. Like I said, if you want to uh, hide a lot of your unused uh, desktop apps, Fence is the way to, is way to go. You can go to um, this website, startup.com. They have a 30-day uh, free trial version. You can download it for free. And if you want to um, buy it, it's all for... Uh, nine dollars and ninety nine cents I uh, like I liked it so much I uh, bought fences and I've been using it for a couple of years I had all versions this is the far best versions for Windows 10 it um, like I said it's organized everything at your uh, fingertips you can uh, it customizes it any uh, to any way you want it like this one set up like with showing my folders to my quick downloads and then I have it one set up for my documents and this here set up for my uh, desktop apps and like if I like access to my um, so uh, my Sony movie studio my video editing tools are here it's, you can organize your desktop any way you want. Any all your files right there on the uh, screen, but hidden, and it's not cluttering up your screen. The uh, like I said, you can find this app. It's available uh, at startup.com. It's uh, they have a 30-day uh, free trial version, and you can go and buy the paid version, which is uh, nine dollars and ninety-nine cents. If you like this video, please like, share, and voice your opinion in the uh, comments section below. And please subscribe for more videos like these. Take care, and I'll see you in the next one. I'll be featuring a thousand subscribers, $150 Amazon gift card giveaway. The only rule is you have to be one of the first thousand subscribers to be eligible. That's it. I will then randomly draw names from the first thousand subscriber list. I will then post the winner in a new upcoming video. The winner will then send me their info on how to receive their gift. You can send that info to my channel email on the about page section. Yeah.